Greetings and salutations. This is Evelina Mala, Lady of the Room. And I was just thinking about something. I was in the middle of watching my Captain Planet show. Yes, yes, I happen to like that show a lot. And no, this is not about environmentalism. That actually was a thought from last night, the day before. And I was thinking about. I've been mean, just randomly watching stuff about feminism on YouTube, and I. The thing is, I am a feminist. I'm also a humanist. I believe everyone deserves rights. I think women have had to go through their share of troubles and trials. And it's good to see a positive role model out of it. But, one of the videos I watched had our. Alright. Edible, strong woman character, Lady Gaga. And in whatever video, in this particular video I saw, I will link it down at the bottom. I wish I could show it up here, but, you know, things happen. But actually, I might just do that. I'll put an annotation right here. There. There for you to click on. However, yeah, I'll wait a minute to two so you can watch the video. Okay, I waited. Anyways, yeah, the video isn't. It's pretty bad. Did you even? Did you notice how she said trendy? I would mean. Feminism trendy. And the reason why I find that personally offensive that she's trying to make feminism trendy is the thing is, it's a political movement. It's also a political stance. So you don't make it trendy so much as you try to lift off the stereotypes of what makes a feminist a feminist. Yes, a feminist fights for women's rights. However, not all women are feminists. They're also male feminists. I don't see them often, but I applaud them when they get up there. Because I think, yeah, that's not, that's a good thing. However, we are also stereotyped for, you know, being men, man haters. And if you noticed anywhere in the comments down below in that video, yeah, they were talking about that. And the thing is, I believe you can be a feminist and stand for women's rights and have absolutely no interest in bashing men. The thing is, it had nothing to do with men. It had nothing to do with hating on men. I mean, yeah, I understand why women would not like a man. Because, right now, a good portion of, of uh, uh, <laughs> is male-dominated. And is that wrong? Not necessarily. Kind of shows an uneven world, but not an unjust one to me. Because to me, it's a matter of choice. Not all women want to become politicians, and that's fair. I like it when they try to motivate girls into that, but the thing is, the way they do it isn't fair. You know, you shouldn't try to push your feminist beliefs on anyone. I chose to be a feminist because I did see strong, powered women growing up. My mother is one. Um, everyone... Uh, everyone in my family, my god sibs, have been a very strong influence in my life. And, let's we'll say, TV shows. A lot of people feel like the Powerpuff Girls... 
are not necessarily strong little models, I guess, because, well, they're little girls. Who's to say a little girl can't be a strong little model for girls? Frankly, I think that's a good place to start. Let it be, little girls. Let it be, you know, boys that had to do stupid things. Because then they realize, wow, I can get hurt. Bad things do happen to me. And that's okay. I'm not perfect, but eventually I will get to that point. Okay, we're not saying they have to be superheroes at birth. You know, and that's another thing I liked. They were also funny. They were able to take a joke. Once in a while. I actually find that really inventive in a superhero. They didn't really quite understood the whole, you know, they're the look at me, I'm Superman, or I'm Wonder Woman kind of thing. That's not exactly strength. The strength is that they are able to take a hit on the head and keep punching. And things like that. And what I've been hearing about feminism as of late is not only are they taking the punches, in fact, actually, they're the ones doling them out more. Yeah, good message, ladies and gentlemen. Good message. Now, I wish I could back it up a little bit more, but it's more of... I've been watching thousands upon thousands of videos. Well, okay, we'll say hundreds. I haven't been watching that much, because if I had, it'd be bigger. But, that's not really what this video is about. Other than, I support feminism because I actually do think the movement does and should be relatable. I think girls still need strong role models just as much as the boys do. But, I think we need to teach them that strong role models don't necessarily have to be women. It can be girls that they think are strong women. Or so much strong women, but something that they would like to be. You know, we, we always push this sort of thinking on each other. And I'm sure boys probably had their share growing up of having their father push their beliefs on them with what a man is. And to me, everyone has a difference of opinion. And that's okay. Hey, not everyone's going to agree. But... I don't think feminism is a one-size-fit-all thing. I think it works in different ways. In fact, there are three types. As According to Wikipedia, there are three. You have cultural, which they just kind of fix the... They're the ones who basically say, or trying to be, they're the ones who say, uh-uh. I am not sitting around the house cooking, cleaning, and taking care of the children. My job is to be myself. Then you got the liberal feminist who's up there on good old Washington or any other, you know, political standpoint and helping to make laws that protect women and men on top of that. Well, not women and men, just, I guess you could say that to the rights of women. And then finally, you got the radical feminists, which I've been seeing way too much of lately. I swear I just can't take it anymore, radical feminist. You know, it's not that they're bad. It's not saying that you can't have a radical feminist. Because frankly, they're not bad. You can have the woman who stands on top of the car saying, We shall not be deterred. And, and, you know, protesting in the street, saying, Damn right, sister. That's good. I think that's positive. I hope people understand. That's not the only view of feminism. And, yeah, I do think fem feminism has been hurt by those stereotypes. I also think it doesn't help when you have women who are punching people in the face and you know, getting away with doing rude, hateful things, because I'm thinking, you know, what is wrong with you, idiots? I'm sorry, but what is wrong with you? And yes, I made a video not too long ago that was about feminism. But, you know, I'm not angry 
I, here's how I got. I was never angry at men. And I hope you guys understand that. And girls, if we want guys to listen to us on this whole thing, we need to just, just chill out and do the bad thing. You know what? I can't have everything. I'm not perfect, and I love myself. As I am. I am a strong feminist. I support feminist organizations. I do suggest doing research because apparently any organization, regardless of what you're doing, seems to be doing something they're not supposed to be doing. Hey, whether it be um, running into an MRA, hey, ses session and rudely and hatefully sitting outside protesting at it, as if they have any right to do so, Two, just being up a guy for making a rape joke. I mean, I'm sorry, you just don't beat them up. You just say, I don't think I like you making those jokes. I don't think they're appropriate, but that's it. And three, You know, there is a point where feminism, in my opinion, has gotten just a little too preachy. You know, you need to stop treating men like they're idiots and assume they're all rape rapists. Also, I kind of wish women would just realize another thing. Hey, okay. we can't have everything sanitized and cleaned down just from your standpoint. Okay? Yes, there are some things that have Offend me on the level of how dare men do that. And I don't blame the men so much as I blame society. Hey, you know, I, I blame feminists who think, yeah, just what I said. Let's go out there and, you know, beat them up and da da da. I hope this video doesn't come off as too repetitive or anything, but that's what I'm saying. Is that I really wish. We can get rid of all the stereotypes and just not have that issue. But I also think, well, it starts off with maybe we women need to realize it's not really fair to impose the idea of feminism on people who don't like it. Anyways, this is feminist fre oh, sorry, this is feminist frequency, apology. But this is a little man, lady of the realm. Telling you to follow me on tw Twitter, Tumblr, and check out my fan fiction in the next few days. There should be something up there. And, and please click subscribe and like this video and share it with whoever and however you can. Good night, everybody.